All right, Halos, welcome back. Uh, we're just going to do a quick recap of the semifinals series that just finished uh, today, actually. Uh, it was yesterday and today as of this recording, and uh, yeah, at Worlds. I just wanted to do a quick, you know, spoiler uh you know warning whatever uh so i was on the swiss stage just so that no one gets spoiled or anything but yeah anyways let's go back into it um semifinals ended up being a 3-0 for billy billy gaming into weibo i wasn't expecting weibo to go down that hard to be honest they were looking like they're um doing a lot better and billy billy was like kind of sketchy although they did end up you know turning it on kind of here at the end um which is good for them, because uh, it would be pretty disappointing if they hadn't, honestly. So I'm excited for them. And yeah, that means they end up going all the way to the finals, of course, here. Um, so pretty much what we would expect at the beginning of the tournament, but not the road that we would have expected them to take. Um, I di wasn't able to watch either of these series really that well, unfortunately. It just didn't have the time, sadly. But either way, um, just wanted to kind of do a quick recap. So yeah, obviously Billy Billy, uh, PLG or whatever, um, defeat Weibo 3-0, so they advance to the finals, and then <clears throat> T1 end up 3-1-ing Gen.G uh, to make it to the finals, which, you know, T1 always does this. I don't know, man. It's really sad for Gen.G, though. Um, it honestly really is. I was kind of hoping that, even though I did end up picking in my pickums, uh, that, Gen that T1 would advance because I keep betting against them and it keeps biting me in the butt. Um, I figured that T1 was going to win it, even though I really wanted kind of I kind of wanted Genji to win honestly um for multiple reasons like it would be cool to be say that FlyQuest uh took the <clears throat> winner of Worlds this year to th uh their to the fifth game whatever you know they were even two up to one in the series against them so uh that would have been a cool story but unfortunately I think Genji just kind of fell off um a little bit here at the end uh, it's really unfortunate I think Honestly, having those extra games is kind of better than going 3-0 in the Swiss stage. Of course, you do get it, get if you go 3-0, you get it out, get out guaranteed in the quarterfinals, obviously. But still, it's I feel like it's a lot better to have those reps because BLG also the same thing. Kind of um, LNG got like only one game, even though they went 3-0 um, against Weibo, and then they ended up losing. So it is kind of unfortunate to be honest, but it is what it is, I guess. Um, <clears throat> And yeah, uh, so anyways, T1 ends up advancing, uh, kind of, you know, plot armor or something, I don't know, but unfortunate for Genji, definitely, uh, it's kind of sad to see them go for sure, uh, but either way, uh, T1 advance, which means T1 versus BLG here at the final, um, yeah, uh, it's going to be interesting, honestly, I think T1 is just going to win, because, um, T1 has this like crazy st stats, has these crazy stats. Every time they make it to Worlds, they at least get to the uh, semifinals at Worlds. <clears throat> um, and then a lot, obviously sometimes they win as well. Um, but they at least get to the semifinals, and obviously this time they went to the finals as well. And uh, I'm fairly certain that they still have not lost to a LPL team in best of fives at least, I believe. Um, maybe, maybe ever. I'm not sure, actually. <clears throat> I think it's just best of fives or something like that. But anyways, um, yeah, it was just kind of crazy, at least at Worlds, um, I, I think. I'm not sure about other tournaments. But yeah, uh, it is pretty nutty, honestly, that, uh, this had happened just again. But, yeah, uh, it's, it's kind of crazy. Anyways, um, I do think TLN's gonna win because I just think... Obviously, they have so many statistics going for them, and they just, I don't know, I mean, they're champions last year, they, no one expected them to do it really last year either, um, and I think people expected even less that they would do it this year, I would say, um, <clears throat> with BLG, Genji, and even maybe Hanwha being like tournament favorites, all three of them, um, and I do think BLG should be, I think T1 should be the, considered the underdogs here, but... Um, <clears throat> At the same time, it's T1, so <laughs> they have such a huge fan base, it's just hard to say. But yeah, anyways, um, I think T1's going to take it. I, oof, I don't know. <clears throat> I don't know. Um, I wonder if we could look at la past Worlds finals to, <laughs> to kind of like get an idea of um, how it would go. Oh, I'm sorry, I need to, to scroll over a little bit, my bad. How's that? Is that a little bit better? There we go. Um, but yeah, I, I think... I th 
think T1's going to take it, obviously, but I think... I mean, we'll see, obviously. BLG could definitely take it. We shall see. But um, T1's, obvious, I think, going to take it. And then I think... Oh, is it going to be a 3-0, 3-1, or 3-2? I don't think it's going to be a 3-0, but it could be. I think it could be a 3-1. Oof, is it going to be a 3-1 or a 3-2? I think it's more likely to be a 3-1 than a 3-2, but it could be a 3-2. I don't know how strong Billy Billy is, honestly. I think they're doing better, but I'm still not like confident in them, although it's I would kind of say the same thing about T1 as well. So, I don't know. I'm going to do the super safe, very boring option. I'm going to go 3-1 for T1. Uh, I do think Billy Billy could take it. 3-1 could go that way as well. It could also be a 3-0 by BLG, which is probably less likely than the other options. But uh, yeah, it could be a 3-2 either way, um, for sure. But yeah, that's kind of what I'm going to go with the guess here. Obviously, um, I was correct in the, saying that BLG would defeat Weibo. I was correct in defeating in saying that uh, T1 would defeat, defeat Gen G. And we'll see if I'm right for the finals. I am super excited for it, though. Um, I believe I have that day off, which is going to be nice from work. So um, I'm, I'll probably watch the, the World's Finals. Obviously, the opening ceremony is going to be cool. I wonder if they're going to do any arcane stuff. I'm not sure. Obviously, we'll have, you know, um, I think Lincoln Park should be there. Hopefully, they'll do some like cool AR stuff as well. But yeah, um, let's go ahead and do our pickums real quick then, which since that's what's gonna, what I think is going to happen. Obviously, I wanted to show this real quick that <clears throat> looks like the majority of people picked uh, BLG and T1 to win these matchups as well, which I ended up getting right, which is nice. And then for finals, like I said, I think T1's going to win. Um, but it could definitely be BLG. It's hard to say. I'm going to say T1, though. I'm going to say T1. But yeah, uh, without further ado, I think that's going to be it for me today. Um, I could go ahead and check out leaders. How are we doing on the, the scoreboard? I'm in the top 5%. Yay, let's go. I'm not in the top 5,000, unfortunately. Um, but I guess we're st we could still get there, maybe? I'm not sure. We're at 200 points, and we just need 15, I think. So far. I'm not sure, though. But yeah, anyways. Um, looks like... Where are we exactly? Okay, so yeah, we're right here. And we got zero perfect picks. Zero perfectly imperfect. I think that updates after it's all done, maybe? But maybe I'm wrong. I'm not sure. Uh, but yeah, we're in S tier so far. That's good. <laughs> uh, obviously, we, we have done a lot of correct predictions this year, but there are definitely some that we haven't. Um, so yeah, it looks like... Is anyone perfect right now? Oh, I think that's... Uh, this is like overall the people that out of like everyone, no one's done like zero. Um, like no one's gotten everything wrong and no one's gotten everything right so far. So I guess all the ultimate skills, uh, all the ultimate skins aren't going to be over to this year again, I think. I don't think anyone got it last year either. Um, but I mean, it is pretty hard, so that's understandable. Um, yeah, you can look at their crystal ball and their picks, obviously, and stuff. So that's kind of cool. Um, let's see. So we are at 200 points, so we're pretty far down this, like, top top list. Oh, we aren't even going to be able to, to see how far down, I guess. But yeah, okay. Anyways, um, yeah, that's going to be it for everyone here. Um, let's check out celebrities, maybe see how we're doing there. Aha, uh -huh, nice. <laughs> so we are tied with the top three celebrities there. Uh, these people, whoever they are, not sure. But yeah, um, other than that, thank you guys for watching, like I said, and I'll catch you guys in, after the finals, kind of do a quick recap, and um, hope you guys enjoy. Definitely tune in, obviously, and it's going to be a fun one. All right, catch you guys there. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't, didn't realize I was, I was uh, on the wrong part, but yeah, this is the celebrities, and this is everyone. My bad, my bad, my bad. But yeah, uh, anyways, yeah, catch you guys in the next one. All right, peace.